So we just learned how the whole world and all the worlds are sustained by our Torah learning. We just learned that uh, Torah learning is beyond the transcendent light of the higher worlds. And in fact, they're dependent on our learning Torah. Torah is so high, even if we can't consciously experience that absolute unity with Hashem, it has such a lofty stature that through learning Torah, a person's able to draw down like the greatest awe of Hashem, which is the purpose of his existence. Because the more awe, then the more they will be drawn to performing the mitzvahs. Goal achieved by learning Torah. And we know that, yes, we do stop our learning Torah to pray, but that's because a person would eventually stop praying to eat and do other things. So it's no indication of its stature. Prayer is combined and as lofty and as great with all of the mitzvahs combined. So the person now learning this will definitely have a greater awe when learning Torah, hopefully. So we can right now close our eyes and experience this awe and cultivate this amazing feeling of wonderment when we engage in Torah studies. Really connect to the powerful energies that you're drawing down into the world and sustaining all of the worlds above. And it's just so delightful that you have that power to create such goodness, to create such a unity with you and Hashem. See yourself just dancing with joy. Practice connecting your conscious mind to the revelation of what is transpiring when you learn Torah. Besides the fact that it really protects you from Ruach Shtus, because Torah learning does act like a shield to protect you. So much good happens when you learn Torah. See now a light from a distance, and you're drawn to this light of the Torah. Really feel the healing energy as you say each word while studying God's Torah. You're so drawn to this light. And as you say each word, you see the power of this transcendent energy reaching the heavens above and then coming back down, sustaining all existence because of you and your learning Torah. You're really having that aha moment. You're going to really make a greater effort to learn Torah Yomam Valayla day and night.
with joy.